you want to defeat an enemy, you must know him well. We all know Spider-Man, but not every spider is as helpful as he is. In today's video we will tell you about poisonous spiders. I hope you never encounter one of these. Then let's get started. Brazilian watering spider, scientifically known as Panutria spp, is a venomous arachnid species native to South and Central America. These spiders can grow to a size of up to 5.5 inches and are recognizable due to their yellow-brown color and long legs. The Brazilian watering spider is considered to be the most venomous spider in the world, and its bite can cause severe and sometimes fatal reactions in humans. Symptoms of the bite include difficulty in breathing, paralysis, and extreme pain. Treatment typically involves anti-venom medication and medical attention. These spiders are usually found in tropical forests, and they are known to wander around looking for prey. To protect themselves, they usually hide inside logs, shoes, and clothes. Fortunately, these spiders are not aggressive and will only bite when provoked or threatened. It is important to be aware of these spiders if you are traveling to South or Central America, as the risk of being bitten remains present. If you spot one of these spiders, it's best to remain calm and contact the authorities for help. The Sydney funnel-web spider is a species of highly venomous spider native to Eastern Australia. It is considered one of the most dangerous spiders in the world due to its highly toxic venom and aggressive behavior. The spider has a unique funnel-web web that it builds to catch prey. It is typically brown in color and has a black body with red or brown legs. The Sydney funnel-web spider is relatively large with a body that can reach up to 5 centimeters in length. It is mostly active during the night and is usually found in dark, moist, sheltered places like logs and burrows. The spider is known to be very aggressive and will bite if disturbed. Its venom is potentially lethal, which is why it is important to seek medical attention immediately if bitten. Mouse spiders are a genus of mygalomorph spiders found in Australia and New Zealand. They are named for their relatively large size, which is similar to that of a small mouse. Mouse spiders are dark in color, typically black or brown, and are typically found living in burrows up to one meter deep. They feed primarily on insects such as crickets and cockroaches, but can also feed on other arthropods such as centipedes and millipedes. Their venom is considered to be very similar to that of a funnel web spider and can potentially cause serious symptoms if a bite is sustained. However, because of their relatively small size and the fact that they are rarely encountered, mouse spiders are not considered to be a high risk to humans. The redback spider is a species of spider native to Australia. It is closely related to the infamous black widow spider but is not quite as dangerous. It is easily identifiable by its black body and red stripe on its back. This spider constructs a web that is usually found near human habitation, such as in wood piles, sheds and closets. The female redback is larger than the male and can reach up to 12 millimeters in length, while the male is only about 3 millimeters long. The spider is venomous and its bite can cause a range of symptoms from mild pain to serious illness. Treatment typically consists of antivenom and pain relief. The brown widow spider is a species of spider native to Africa, but recently introduced to the United States. The body is slender and elongated, and the carapace is typically dark brown. The hourglass-shaped marking on the underside of the abdomen is yellow or orange and is unique to the species. Brown widows are not as dangerous as their more well-known relatives, the black widow, and usually only bite if provoked. Their venom is usually not serious and can result in minor muscle cramps and pain. Brown widows typically live in abandoned buildings or other man-made structures, like window frames and garages. 